I do like this mascara for the volume that it gives. Pretty stinking good. But I have also been wearing false eyelashes like every single Sunday and whenever I can because I'm just in love with these new ones that I got. Okay, I just went and got some new ones and I, I use them. I mean, I clean them all the time. As long as you don't get the lashes wet and you just take the stuff off the band and then disinfect them, you can use these for a long time. So don't just buy one, use it just twice and then throw them away, okay? The Demi Wispies I have found to be the most natural um, to where people just think they're your own eyelashes. If I didn't wear them to church now, since we've only been to this new ward for two weeks, they'd probably be like, what happened to your eyelashes? Because I really do think that they look real. Um, a tip is not to pull out the eyelashes. Cool. But um, always cut them. Always, always, always cut them. Okay? So having really long eyelashes on the inside, that's not natural. So figure out where you would want to cut them and cut the inside. Okay, so leave the long ones on the outside, cut the inside. Now I personally like mine to kind of be like that. And then I'll probably cut from here over. Okay, so I'll just take my scissors and cut that little bit. And then to make them even, I take the other ones I guess this is a little mini lash tutorial. I take my other ones and I take the ones that I've already done, I put them together and I just cut off what's hanging over, okay? So, and remember to cut the inside. Um, as they say in most lash tutorials, and it could not be more true, put on your glue, wait till it's tacky, blow on it, whatever, then put it on. Another thing that I like about these is the band is invisible. It's got a little bit of glue just from being on there, but it's not black like normal. So just use your adhesive, put it on, wait till it's tacky. Um, something that I learned from a YouTuber is that you can put a little bit on your hand and then put it on here. And once you feel this being tacky, then obviously you know that this is tacky. I think I've got this down to an art though, so I know when it is. So go ahead and put on your falsies. Now I'll see you in a second. Okay, when you're putting on lashes, get as close to the lash line as possible. And then I push from the outside instead of trying to put my fingers on here because your fingers have grease on them. It will make the glue not work as well. So push from the outer edges of the lashes in. Okay, and then just let it sit. Don't mess with it. Don't play with it too often. Or don't play with it so much that it'll lose its stickiness. Okay, so that's what that one looks like and the glue will dry clear. Something else that you can do is since these lashes are supposed to mold together, you can push, pinch them. Okay, and I'll be doing another small little coat. That's why you're only supposed to do, this is why I think you should only do one coat first, because you're gonna be doing a little bit more of a coat to kind of blend them together, so you don't want it to be too clumpy. So literally just a coat will do it. Something else I like to do while they're drying is I like to, since these are new, can't really see what I'm doing, can you? I like to bend this so that it'll get ready for the curve of my eye. Okay, it kind of helps. And then just keep waiting until it's tacky. Okay, so I've got my lashes on. I just put this one on, so I'm gonna let it dry a little bit more just by pushing on the, literally just on the outside of the lash, pushing it into place, okay? So I'm gonna put a coat on the bottom. Now, to mold these lashes together, I'm gonna put my pinky behind. That way, I have something to back against and I can just do the base to make sure those eyelashes stay together. Okay, I'm gonna do that with the other side. 
I usually just do it at the base. I don't like going all the way up with falsies. Okay, and then in the middle, do your natural lashes. Or on the inside, I guess I should say. And then you are done, okay? If you have anything that you see that needs to be filled in, like if the glue is kind of weird, like over, where am I, over here? I'll probably take a little bit more of my liner and go over that. But other